we've selected the two crops, the cassava and the sweet potatoes, because they are fairly drought tolerant. In the context of Tanzania, we take it as a food security crop because in areas where rainfall is very unreliable, well, then we normally look for crops which can withstand a high degree of uh, a drought. system that we are introducing has several components to it. The dairy goats, the sweet potato and cassava, and then the feeding system which uh, is intended to feed the root crops to the humans and then certain parts of the plant uh, from the root crops are fed to the goats. And so the system is intended to work together to improve diets of humans as well as the goats themselves. And in turn, the goats will be more productive, uh, will grow larger, will produce more milk and uh, provide more benefits for the farmers.